What's up everybody, my name is Kamil Tunetsky and today I'm going to show you some pretty cool cables from Hesu. So a couple days ago I received my package from Hesu, I ordered some guitar cables which are unbalanced, as well I've got some balanced cables and some cabinet cable and some Axtolar to TRS cable. I will run these cables in my reamping process. We will find out how these cables will work in the pre-processing of the guitar tone. Let's go! Alright, so now for a moment let's talk about a signal flow in our reamping process. From the audio interface the signal goes into a reamp box and I'm using a balanced cable. From the reamp box signal goes into my boost and I'm using unbalanced cable. Then from the boost signal goes into the input of my amplifier and I'm using the unbalanced cable as well. Then the amplified signal through the speaker output goes into a load box and I'm using the cabinet cable. And finally the last step of my reamping chain, the signal out of the load box goes into the input of my audio interface and I'm using the balanced cable. Ok, so now the signal flow is ready. Let's jump into my DAW and we'll find out how it works. Alright, so I have my session routed up. The green tracks are the DIs. Uh, the orange tracks are the DIs as well, but in the quad tracking setup. So in the DI tracks everything is flat. On the track where the reamp signal will lay down. I have torpedo wall of sound with some IR because we are reamping only the uh, I'm the I signal from the Victory the Kraken and uh, the point is that later on you can use any kind of IR that you want to, to lay down in your mix. I've got some kind of EQ of cutting down some you know nasty uh, frequencies and cut some of the low end uh, but it does not affect my signal so let's hear the sound of my DI track. Alright, so I'm hitting the recording button and let's find out what kind of magic is happening right here. Alright, now we will reamp the second rhythm tour, the one that will be panned right in the mix. Still, I'm running the first channel of the Victor the Kraken, which is more like the crunchy channel. Yeah, let's hit it. Okay, so we have the main rhythm tone reamped. Now we will change the channel of the amplifier, the second one, which is more high gainy. We will reamp the third and the fourth part of my tartone. Here. Now let's uh, go to the four DI track and let's hit the record button. Now I'm gonna pan the reamped tracks. So let's say minus 95. Second one is opposite for the 95 right. And the quad track rhythm tone minus 75. And the last one plus 75 right. Okay, so now I have the reamp tracks of my guitars over here. Let's hear the reamp tracks of my guitars. Now, see the backing track. And finally, let's hear the reamp tracks of guitars and my backing track of drums, bass, and vocals. Oh 
by the way, if you want to watch the music video of this song with the guitars reamped by me and the final mix made by Thomas Zalewski at Z Studio, you can click the link somewhere out here. So there you have it, the cables from Hesu. I believe these are great quality cables, especially when it comes to a pre-processing of the guitar tone. These are really great cables. Oh, and one more thing, if you like the content of my videos, please hit the thumb up and subscribe and you'll be notified about next videos. Cheers!